Yeah, yeah. Gang them, we don't give no fuck who you can to For who you with, who look in, turn your skin blue Gossip it, all on Facebook, I'm friend you Treat it like a fool, oh yeah, lot of shit to prove, oh yeah Bad ass kid out the school, in the car with a two, yeah Mama said, listen here boy, I don't want you standing over there Few niggas that's from the land, they can't even come around here In this game, ain't playing fair Yo, yo what's cooking? What's the name? Where you from, man? Man, yo, it's your boy L. Hitter, Mr. All Year. I'm from the west side of Chicago, born and raised. Where your name come from, bro? Um, my name used to be L. Hitler. And um, the, what made me want to change it is because I knew I was going to the next level. So, and I also know that the industry is ran by Jews. So, I, um, I ended up changing it to L. L. Hitler because that was the closest to Hitler. So um, I came up with my name. I was just thinking of all different bad guys, you know what I'm saying? Like it, you know that that we know about, like as in from the scar faces and you know shit like that. So um, I don't know. I just I just I just uh, started getting into that. I started reading about them, and I'm like, you know, what, I'm gonna go with Hitler. So I my my rap name was Easy Hitler, but I'm like, nah, that sounds too cheesy. So I'm like, man, I gotta choose, I gotta, I gotta have something that's gonna stand out. And I was in, I was into the El Chapo story as well. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, man, you know what? El Hitler don't sound bad. And I ran with that shit. But once I knew it was time for me to over transition over, I made a decision before they could even make it for me. Mm -hmm. Dope, dope. When did you realize you had time for music? Say that again. When you realize you had time for music? Um, when I went to jail. When I went to jail, it was when I'm when I when I knew for a fact, like damn, I got it, cause motherfuckers used to be paying me to write their girl poems and do this and do that, and I'm like, damn, if I can get this impact in here, imagine what I can do out there. All right. All right. Describe your childhood growing up. But, I, but growing up, I was I was I wasn't quiet, but I was. I was trying to, I was, basically I was trying to find myself, you know what I'm saying? I was trying to see what I wanted in life, like what I wanted to do. My grandma and, and, and my daddy used to put us in all different type of um, activities, like dance class, tutoring, all type of stuff, but I never knew what it was for. And it all paid off right now. But um, I, was, I, was, I was quiet, I didn't, I didn't get into too much trouble, I didn't get into too many fights. Shit, uh, rapping wasn't even my thing. Like I, I used to, I used to like playing basketball a lot. You feel me? But I just, shit. Once I seen that I, you know what I'm saying? I got a passion for that shit. Writing, I'm like, I gotta, I gotta do something with this. And so, shit, I'm like, fuck it. I transitioned over to rap, um, rapping when I was like 12, 13. You know, that's when I, that's when I knew for a fact what I wanted to do. But yeah, um, shit. My child, <coughs> my childhood was cool though. My OG, she was a single parent. I got two. I got. I got. I got uh, four more other siblings. I got two sisters and I got two brothers, and we all close. Yeah. Describe your creative process, making music. Uh, she would. I write music. I listen to the beat. And and I say maybe like thirty minutes. I didn't listen to the beat maybe at least ten times. Just to know, because I can start writing to the beat right then and there as soon as I hear that bitch, but ah, I, I wait, like, okay. Cause maybe I might like, come up with a better flow. So that's why I really wait type shit, but my, my, me writing music so easy, man. It's shit, shit easy as hell, bro. It's like, cause this is the only way I can express myself. And a lot of, a lot of motherfuckers don't be like, you know what I'm saying, wanna hear me talking shit. So if I know I say this in this music, y'all ain't got no choice but to hear me. So that's why I put my passion and my energy into that shit because I want a motherfucker to know, like, damn, Shorty Sids, like, he for real. That's why I don't really be rapping about too much shoot 'em up, bang bangs. I just talk about the shit I go through, you feel me? Like, 
I used to be in the streets, you feel me? It's, you know what I'm saying? I was hustling shit for survival. So, but I'm not in the streets right now, so, you know what I'm saying? It's like, it's there really no need for me to talk about that shit. I, I gotta talk about what I've been through in life. I'm just, you know, if I was standing up on the block, then I could talk about standing on the block, but I ain't standing on nobody's block, you feel me? So, shit. Um, yeah, that's how, that's, that's, yeah, that's, that's how I make my music and shit. Alright, so that's what I was gonna say. Describe your music and what makes you different. Um, what makes me different is my metaphors. For how I put my metaphor, um, you won't even know it's a metaphor. And then once you sit back, you're like, damn, this nigga got a mind of Wayne. And that was my idol. But shit, um, yeah, man, my music, shit, I just, shit, I just try to think of, because everybody say the same shit in their music. I just try to, Think of other different ways to put it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, I say, bro, you definitely you got this energy, bro. That ain't nobody got this energy, bro. Like, I don't know how you, people tell you that all the time about your energy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you got this energy, bro. You just you like to roam up. I don't know, bro. You just got some energy. Like, where it come from? Uh, it actually came from uh me being nervous from going into this. Like, I didn't know what I was going into, I just knew what I wanted. I wanted to be famous. And I didn't know what was came behind it. I didn't know losing loved ones came behind it. I didn't know losing close people, you know what I'm saying? Like, the closest people. Like, a change on you for this shit, you feel for this material shit. It's fucked up though, it, it, but this life I chose and I can't even change it. Cause I'm too far deep into this shit. All right. Damn. The next song you dropping, what it's called, bro? It's called Do It For John, man. Um, it's, it's, it's power behind this this song. But for, for people who that's, that's fighting depression, you know, afraid to talk to people, um, who just who just battling a lot of certain things that they can't get back in life. So I made Do It For John so people can understand, like, it's okay for this. You know what I'm saying? You can do this. You know what I'm saying? Like, my little brother, he took his life, so I'm gonna let you know how not to. The, the, the steps, not so you can't take your life. You know what I'm saying? Like, cause that shit ain't, that shit, it hurt uh, a human taking their life. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, shit, we don't know if we gonna see each other on the afterlife. We don't know what's behind this. Mm -hmm. We don't. So, shit, it, it might not even be no that or that. You know what I'm saying? So, mm -hmm. see, we just gotta. Man, we just gotta make the best out of everything and, and, and get through our problems that we fight. And after that, after after my little brother hurt himself, man, bro, I ain't gonna lie, shit. Then my, well, I, I stopped getting depressed, all that shit. And yeah, no, I ain't. That's what I was gonna get into. Like, when people take their lives, they don't understand, like, how well, it affects the people around them as well. What's that, my boy? I said when people take their life, it affects the people around them as well. I don't think they understand that. Like, a part of you go with them. That's how you feel? Yeah. Like, like, it, it just made me understand why I should appreciate my life. Mm hmm Because if it get to the point where you got to take yourself out, man, you mean to tell me, like, you can talk to nobody? You know what I'm saying? Like, it shit, this shit just, yeah, shit just be crazy. Some people is like, they're uncomfortable, man. They, they want to have this wall up. They want to be seen a certain way, you know what I'm saying? But sometimes you just got to open up, man. Real shit, man. And you can't be afraid to open up, so just do it for Judd track. That bitch, that, that bitch, yeah, that, that's one of them, man. That's one of them. All right, we finna go ahead and drop your new track, do it for John, man. Get it. Yeah, yeah. Baby G is here. Let's go. Damn, LeBro. I wish I could have talked to you before. All this shit occurred. But shit happens in life, baby. 
do it for John. Running shit out with my family, nobody up because I'ma just do it for John. Don't let it get to your head and it fuck up your health, so I'ma just do it for John. If you're afraid, just talk to somebody. Don't be afraid, just do it for John. We took a loss, but we already won. Let's do it for John. Do it for John. Running shit out with my family, nobody up because I'ma just do it for John. Don't let it get to your head and it fuck up your health, so I'ma just do it for John. If you're afraid, just talk to somebody. Don't be afraid, just do it for John. We took a loss, but we already won. Let's do it for, for John. John. I cannot believe this. And I ain't crying a minute, you was the one that we missing So many stories I'm gonna be telling my children We used to be in the building Bitch, I'ma do it for John and tell him I did it Quit, I got you, just know you ain't lose a thing I know an angel was given Ah, no matter what you go through Gotta stay close to your siblings, get out your feelings I'm giving out so much energy Do it for John, really, do it for Ron Von 50, I lost so much in this big ass city Reason why I cannot stop drinking Remy Look at my eyes, do they look teary Lost boy, then I found myself No high feel, not to hide no help Run a mile with the Grim Reaper Man, I swear to God, you could tie to death Late night, we was masked up You was one nigga that was hard to scare Remember days I was locked down Didn't believe in God, I was tired of prayer Do it for John, running shit up with my family Nobody up because I'ma just do it for for John. Don't let it get to your head and it fuck up your health, so I'ma just do it for John. If you're afraid, just talk to somebody. Don't be afraid, just do it for John. We took a loss, but we already won. Let's do it for John. Do it for John. Running shit out with my family, nobody up because I'ma just do it for John. Don't let it get to your head and it fuck up your health, so I'ma just do it for John. If you're afraid, just talk to somebody. Don't be afraid, just do it for John. We took a loss, but we already won. Let's do it for John. Oh, oh, you played the beat this bitch too soft. I'm true, man. Let's rock money up, bro. This shit, wait, look. This here before a deal, so don't even trip, man. All I want is money and straps 2020, 2021, bitch. Yeah, that's all I want. If it ain't that, fuck. How you feel about rap and the internet? Rapping and the internet? Yeah, like the rap game. Uh, I ain't gonna lie, like, I feel like that shit ain't valid, bro. On some real shit, that shit ain't valid, bro. Like, real niggas, bro, niggas, we don't motherfucker don't play that internet shit, bro. On some real shit. You know how this, this, this internet shit can manipulate your mind. Like, niggas know. So if you if you know this shit can manipulate your mind and you feed you go towards that way, I don't see you know you a motherfucker I can't rock with at all. But my son, like, the internet powerful, bro. Yeah. You can't team up with, you know what I'm saying? You can't do nothing. Come on, man. I don't see, you know, great, like the internet, if, if you ask me, I feel like that shit is made to made, you know what I'm saying, to tap people down and all that shit. Like I'm saying, don't get me wrong, you build your platform shit, but look how many motherfuckers have failed. And got oh, got two down because of this, you know, this internet shit. You yeah. feel me? But real motherfuckers know we don't pay that internet shit, bro. Mm -hmm. On some real shit. And if you a rapper, bro, like, come on, man. You know, you come on, man. You know the police. Like, I, 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 I probably, I'm clean as a whistle right now. You know what I'm saying? Like, but it's still somebody that's connected to that that's listening. Mm -hmm. On my son. Real shit. A lot of niggas dying doing goofy shit, bro, for mm -hmm. this image just for the internet, man. Facts. Facts, bro. Alright, so how many times you been arrested, bro? Um, shit, I've been arrested a lot of times. Shit, I've been. I'm 27 right now, shit. I, um, I've been getting locked up since I was 15. And I just stopped getting locked up when I was 21. I left the drink when I was 21, 22. But shit, man, bro, I got locked up so many times, bro, over, over, over being loyal to some motherfuckers who I know for a fact when he, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I don't see no grave, bro, like, like, man, that's another story though, but, see, yeah, I, I, I been locked up a lot of times, and I ain't proud of that shit. You feel me? Right. That shit. But that shit made me who I am right now. Mm -hmm. Maybe shit, me getting locked up was a good thing on some real shit, cause I made some hits in that bitch. I made Burn one in jail. I made it's a lot of songs I got right now that I got out that I made in jail mm -hmm. on my son. Like a lot of that shit. 
Alright, have you ever been in a situation you thought you were going to die? Uh... No. Because when the situation happened, I don't even think about death. I just think about me getting out of that situation. Yeah. So, yeah, so, um... Mm, mm, no. Good, good. What y'all run is, like you say, going back and forth to jail, what you think you can do different to avoid them situations? Mm. So, for the shortest. Um, shit, I could have, I could have, I could have been true to myself, shit, I could have, shit, stood on business, um, shit, not been afraid to change, really, because you know you were surrounded environment so much, all uh, you thinking, you know what I'm saying, like, okay, I gotta do what they, but then once you really step back and, and, and it shifts, it's like, it's just a lot of shit that come behind that, so, shit. All right. What's the average day for you, waking up, going to sleep? Um, mm, you see, what's the average day for me, yeah. waking up, going to sleep? Yeah. Shit, <clears throat> I wake up in the morning, shit, to my kids, you know what I'm saying, shit, my son and my daughter. I wake up, shit, I smoke me some, you know what I'm saying, I smoke me some weed, cause I, I got a lot of shit on my mind, you feel me, so weed, that's gonna balance it, mm -hmm. you feel me? It's like, it's like, that shit, that shit balanced my thoughts and I, I could really, you know what I'm saying, get, get, get that shit together, but, um, shit, after I smoke me a little weed, you know, I'm always, every day, all day, I listen to beats and write, like, that shit, it's just me, you feel me, that's just like my little personal diary, you feel me, like, shit like that, but, shit, I just be chilling on my son, I just bought me a game, I don't really be playing the game, cause I be too, too focused on writing music and shit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, my kids, so I don't be having time, but I just got me one just, you know what I'm saying, just keep my head out of the dumb shit. Yeah. Um, All right, so describe a perfect day, what you'll be like, what what can happen that be like, damn, today was a good ass day. Shit, I ain't gonna, um, see, when I drop videos, or I shoot a video, or something concerning my success that's got established, you know what I'm saying, like, mm -hmm. Uh, that shit, that shit make me feel good. Like, this, this is a good day. Like, you know what I'm saying? If I got goddamn it, let's say, shit. You know what I'm saying? Long as some coming in every day, like every day I wake up, I always think of how I'm gonna make this income. You know what I'm saying? How, how, how this, how, how, how this bag gonna check this today? You know, how this gonna go? And when it, 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 shit been working out good, you feel me? Yeah. Shit definitely been working out good. So, shit, long as shit. My keep waking up, seeing my kids smile. They ain't got no fever, sick and all that. My girl straight, you know what I'm saying? Shit, I'm cool. I got something established. That's a good day for me. Yeah. All right. Dope, man. Fatherhood, bro. Beautiful. All right. What's your is biggest inspiration in music and why? Um. My biggest inspiration is my kids. And that's because, like, I know I gotta, you know, so we I gotta feed them. Mm -hmm. I gotta feed them. Like that's like that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? So waking up, seeing them, you gotta get that bag for them. Mm -hmm. All right. And what's up next for you with the music? What you dropping next? What's cooking? Um, I'm actually finna ready to drop two singles back to back. I'm finna drop "Shut Me Up" two. And I'm finna drop my best friend. You feel me? Two bangers back to back. I'm finna fuck this tree up on my son with these. Yeah. Shut me up too. And my best friend. So yeah. Now, I heard you going on tour. What's up? What's up? Oh uh, yeah, man. I'm finna, I'm finna, I'm finna go on tour March 30th. You feel me? I'm finna get my man right. Focus. You feel me? That bitch finna be busting. First stop, Arizona. You feel me? Arizona, Tucson. And it's another one that start with an M. I don't know how to pronounce that bitch. That's how you know we, you feel me? We, we gone. Right. No shit. All right, one thing I want to ask, bro, how it feel, bro, to be on stage and motherfuckers singing your song, bro? How that shit feel? A lot of niggas don't never experience that. Now, I ain't gonna lie, that shit feel good, bro, because that's how I know 
I always I, I started rapping to get my point across, and that's how I know I kind of got my point across. Yeah. When motherfuckers say like, "Damn, okay, we feel you, we mm -hmm. hear you." Right. So that shit, that shit is amazing, bro. To sell a sell a sell a arena, I will sell sell a club, shit, whatever it is. Mm -hmm. You sell that bitch out, man, bro. Like it's it's more so. That's why I never stopped grinding. That's why I got so many so many songs and shit because I like shit. Motherfucker got me fucked up. You feel me? Mm -hmm. And then I'm 27. I already built a platform. So it's it's you know what I'm saying. The, you know the industry don't want a motherfucker when they get 30. Mm -hmm. You already gotta have a platform. So the good thing about me, shit went. You know, shit happened. Mm -hmm. But I was, you know what I'm saying. I still was able to fight through that shit. Yeah, yeah. All right, man, well said, man. You been doing your motherfucking thing, bro. Like I say, you doing it big. Ain't nobody in Chicago, bro, can really do the numbers you doing, bro. So keep doing your thing. Fuck the streets up. Niggas here to give you your flowers, bro. Appreciate it, my boy. My nigga. Salute. You know how we come. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah.